Okay, hello everyone, uh, I'm Medo and today I'm going to show you how to install a custom smart card file onto your smart card for your Tamagotchi Smart. That's a lot of smart. <laughs> hey, so, um, what you need first of all is, of course, a smart card that you are okay to overwrite and you're going to need a programmer tool. Uh, the one I'm using is made by Pasjo on Coffee. Uh, you can buy it from his coffee shop, so I'm gonna link it in the description if you have any need. There is also an option of DIYing your own programmer. Uh, it's not something I try myself, but um, there are videos that showcase it, so if you're interested, I will, I will also put videos link in the description okay so this program behind me <laughs> is as programmer and this is what you're gonna use to reprogram your smart card yes so alors, um, <laughs> so first of all you're gonna pro you first of all you're gonna plug your USB programmer into your computer with the smart card plugged into it. <laughs> then you should hear a uh, little like doom from your computer saying it's uh, detected. Once you've done that, the first step is to click read ID. It's the icon with the question mark. It should pop up this window. So you're gonna double click on the first option. Okay, and then you can close the window. All right. Next, you're gonna click read IC. So it's the first option with the green arrow. You let it process. <laughs> Alright, so now it's done. So before editing anything, we are gonna unprotect because the smart card has like has like a protection thing. So it's here on the what do you say lock lock. So you don't click on the lock directly. No, you click on the lock. <laughs> Sorry, it's been a while again. I've done it. So you click on the lock. It's unprotected. Next, um, if it's a smart card, you want to preserve the previous file that was on it. You can save the file using the saving option, the memory card. Memory card, yeah. <laughs> so you can click on it and save it as whatever you want. Okay. So, once you use your saved or you don't save, you do what you want, okay? Um, we are gonna erase the code now. So, it's erase IC with the red cross. Erase IC, yes. It's, it's faster in real life. Um, mine is taking a bit longer because I'm recording, so my poor computer is having a hard time processing things. Okay, it's already done. So, now we arrive, erase. I'm sorry, I can't speak today. Um, so, to check there is no issue, we're gonna do verify IC and the arrow. Blank check. Because uh, we erased everything, so it's like empty. All right, so we have cleared the code. We have checked the memory, so now it's time to open our custom file. So you can open the file with the folder icon. And uh, mm, I'm gonna reboot because it's my card from my snatcher card, so I'm gonna reboot it. 
Voilà. So, once you loaded the file, it should show the new name here of the file you uploaded. Next, since we opened our file, now we can program it. So, programming is the red arrow. Program I see. Begin programming, yes. Once it's done programming, we can do another verify I see. Okay, so each time you do a verify, if you don't have any red uh, red text at the end, you're good. So you're good. So we're almost done. If you remember at the beginning we removed the protection, so now we're gonna put it back to finish. So we come back to the lock and we click the arrow and we click set the protection bits. And we're technically done, we can rerun another verify IC just to be sure, but uh, it's good. So just another one, just to be sure. Yo, let's go. <laughs> and voila, technically we are done. So you can close AS Programmer and unplug your USB, <laughs> USB Programmer. And you can use your Thumbass My Car with your Thumbagotchi Smart. You're good. Let's go. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Uh, I'm not very used to making videos, so I'm sorry if it's a bit uh, messy. Uh, I I just wanted to do this too, so I hope it was clear enough. I try to make it as as clear as possible. So if you have any other question, please let me know. Um, Oh yeah, um, for this video I wanted to turn on the latest version of AS Programmer, but um, I was getting an issue, like uh, it couldn't detect my programmer for some reason, so... I'm gonna tell you like which, this is like an anterior version that I'm using, you can like, since it's a... Uh, you can just download the older version of the program like me if it solved it for you and uh, i think that's all have a good day bye